Families and educators alike value teamwork, grounded in trusting relationships between home and school. I use two words a lot with my parents, teamwork and patience. Teamwork because we have to work together. I tell my parents to be patient with me because I'm still trying to catch our students up to their uh, level. I also tell parents, be patient with your student because they're trying, they're giving their best. They give their best to me and they try to give their best to their parents. And I tell their parents to be patient with themselves because some of my parents get frustrated. I don't know why they can't do addition or subtraction. It takes time. I am very comfortable of my son being here because I know that he's in good hands. While parents and educators team up, there remains a disconnect between what parents think and teachers know about student performance. More than 9 in 10 parents believe their child is at or above grade level, while only 44% of teachers say most of their students are prepared for grade level work. Sometimes parents have a um, unrealistic perception of their scholar and their academics, and that's no fault to them. Sometimes we have to take ownership on the school level of how we communicate academics to parents, how we communicate standards to parents. I've been at this school for about four years, so my second year here, we sent home the assessment results, and a parent called and said, you sent home this assessment? I don't know what this is, and I'm like, we did not explain to parents like how to read this assessment report. Both parents and educators agree that families having a clear picture of student achievement is a top priority, and trust and teamwork describe the connection they would like to have between home and school. Not doing it like once a month, not doing it like every two months, but doing it consistent where the parents feel that the school care about them, that the, the, the school is invested in their child, the school is invested in the, the livelihood of families. So one thing I always do is make sure that um, parents know they see me and I'm visible, and teachers also see that I'm communicating with parents and I know them by name. So teachers see me calling parents by name, they see me calling students by name. Educators and families deserve systems that prioritize trust and teamwork. What does that look like for your community?